All right, guys, today I'm going to show you how to recover a bricked Express LRS receiver. Now, first thing to remember is that you cannot permanently brick any of the Express LRS hardware. You can always recover a receiver. It's got a built-in bootloader in the chip itself that can't be overwritten, so this method will always work. All right, so step one is that we have to disable telemetry on Betaflight, not in Express LRS itself, but in Betaflight. So if we connect to our FC, we go to configuration, we make sure telemetry is off. Uh, the reason we need this to be off is because Betaflight always sends telemetry and that signal interferes with the bootloader signal that we're trying to communicate with. So now that that's disabled, I go back to my receivers here. And the next step is to put the receiver into bootloader mode or DFU mode. And depending on your receiver, there's two main ways to do this. Um, on these small receivers, there's these little pads just above the ground. You have to either put a pair of tweezers on them to hold them together, to short them together, or maybe it might be easy just to put a little bit of a temporary solder on there. If you've got a bigger receiver like this Axis Flying one, it usually has a button and you can just use the button itself. They kind of do the same thing. And so the key thing to put into bootloader is to either um, short, short that pad or press that button and then apply power. So the button has to be pressed or the pad has to be shorted before you apply power. So I'm just going to do that here. And we're going to press the button and then apply power. Okay, so the receiver is now in bootloader mode. And then all I have to do is go over to my Express LRS configurator, select the via betaflight pass-through method and just build and flash as per normal. All right, there it goes. So it's uploading. You should see some flashing from your flight controller. And then in a second, it'll finish, it'll reboot, and it'll be alive again. Telemetry recovered. There we go, you've recovered your receiver. Um, now if you have trouble with this, first thing to do is relax, breathe, try it again. Each attempt at this, so each time you press uh, build a flash on the configurator, you have to have a fresh state. So if you if this attempt failed, I can't just click build and flash again. I've got to unplug, push the button, replug. All right, it has to be fresh because all the timings are critical. If you're still having issues, join the Discord server. I'll personally help you out. All right. So I hope that was helpful for someone, and I hope this can help people recover their receivers if they're having issues. Cheers.